Hi, it's Gene from Mexico. No bumper. We're going to get right into it. This is my favorite artist, number 112. And so what's the criteria of 133 artists? It's all down below, but basically I made 133 playlists and listened to them for a year, ranked them. And then I also consider the live experience and what my general interest is in the band in terms of books, magazines, and that kind of thing. So anyway, hit that like or subscribe button. It really helps. And I think we have a good one today at number 112. So I do like international music. So we're going outside the United States and Europe for this band and i've seen them twice in concert once in 2011 down in tucson arizona i drove all the way down there just to see this band i had no other reason to go to tucson and then i saw them in 2014 in phoenix arizona at the beautiful musical instrument museum which is perfect sound and both shows were were just fantastic. Uh, I think I enjoyed the second one a little more because I was closer, had better acoustics, and there was no opening band. So, And this band is all guitars and percussion. Okay? No, um, I don't even think they have a bass. No, they don't have a bass player. They use a big round drum to do the bass. Uh, they used to be a multi-gender band with men and women in the band, but they've morphed into an all- male band and when i saw them in concert i thought that they had a certain masculinity about them that i really liked in the same way that i like a feminine artist or a feminist or a feminine band not feminine well maybe feminist right but uh yeah so this band is from way up in the corner of mali north africa and that's the birthplace of the blues or at least music historians say so. And all the great uh, blues music came down from this region into the uh, Caribbean and the South and parts of South America and found its way up to the United States. And, and we have all the great blues artists today because of that. So I'm talking about the band Tenariwen. Very unusual band. Desert Nomads. Um, yeah, and so this section uh, of the map that I'm showing you here, they're right up against Algeria, so they do have some Algerian musicians in the band, but everything is medium tempo generally. But when I saw them in concert, they did do one fast tempo song just to show that they could burn on guitar, but we're used to ballads and rockers, and these guys, these guys do tempos right in the middle. And I love it. It's it's very sedu seductive. It's, um, you know, maybe reminiscent of reggae in its tempo, but not reminiscent in its rhythms at all. It's very blues-based. And they're considered pioneers or forefathers of desert blues. And very interesting history. Now, their recordings outside of Africa started in 2001. So in the Western world... They're completely uh, a 21st century band, but they have been around, according to Wikipedia, since 79. So they had some recordings back in the 20th century. So they've been around a while, but uh, I absolutely love this band. Uh, I can't believe they're only 112 on my list, but yeah, I got a lot of people that I like. And uh, yeah. You know, if you haven't heard them, they're just so seductive. Yeah, you don't know what they're singing about, but their background is so interesting, including the fact that these guys went to Libya and trained under Mamar, Muammar Gaddafi. Yeah, very interesting. And some of their albums uh, have pictures of them with guitars and machine guns. And the albums that I own, uh, one's in a binder. So I, it was a big effort to find the binder, get to the page, open it up. So it's Amen Ami, Aman Iman. Aman Iman. Maybe I'm mispronouncing that wrong. I'm not looking at it right now, but it means water of life. 
and that's the first album I ever bought with them, by them, and I was hooked. And then I have this Grammy award-winning album. That's right, uh, Tassili, which uh, yeah won uh, the Grammy award for best um, international album. So great band. I've got a playlist below. Check it out. Uh, I think it's uh, really great. And as we say here in Bonita, Mexico, buen dia.